Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Kyler. I'm Kayla. And we're headed for anywhere. In this episode, we're going to take you through the first part of our Eastern Sierra trip. We're going to start off uh, somewhere in Lone Pine and Alabama Hills. And then we're going to head up towards Bishop for a little while. And then towards Mammoth Lakes. So we're going to hit a couple different stops along the way. We're going to try our uh, hand at fishing. <laughs> no luck. <laughs> Keep watching to follow along the journey. We hope you like what you see. Where you at? In your national forest. We are in low time. We're heading up towards uh, Whitney Portal so that we can try and do a little fishing this morning. And uh, I think after that, maybe we're gonna head and try and camp in like the Alabama Hills area tonight. Should be exciting. I don't know if you could hear me, but we are down by the stream in Whitney Portal. The stream leads down to the fishing pond. We went down there and fished earlier. It looks like the Department of Fish and Game actually just stocked the pond. So, a uh, ton of bites. I caught about four little trout. Taylor caught, uh, Taylor caught a couple. So, I'd say it's definitely a very successful day. pulled off into our camp here. We're in Alabama Hills currently. Uh, we found this very cool secluded spot. You definitely need a four wheel drive to get back here. Um, the Jeep was able to make it no problem. We've yet to unload all our stuff, but I wanted to give you guys a quick look before we did, just so you guys could get a good idea of how we have everything packed in there currently. As you know, that Grom goes on the back here with my motorcycle carrier. This is where we keep our food. This is a Dometic CFX 50 quart fridge. We have our two roam boxes here stacked nicely. We have our dry foods in the top one, cooking utensils in the bottom one. Those will come out here soon. On the side, tucked away nicely, we have my uh, Renergy 100 watt solar panel. We got some fishing supplies, chairs, backpack, camera stuff, my scottle, jacket, and clothes. Like I said, it's kind of messy right now since we haven't fully unloaded, but I want to give you guys a quick look at how the Jeep is set up. Ready for a little hike? Bishop, but first we're gonna have ourselves a nice hearty breakfast of uh, Apple Jacks, of course the almond milk.
Monday, July 20th, and we are somewhere outside of Bishop, California. Last night, my buddy Austin rolled in. We drove up Highway 168, if I'm not mistaken. It's an offshoot from the 395, and it goes up Bishop Creek all the way up to Lake Sabrina. So I think the game plan for today is we're gonna make some coffee, make some quick breakfast. We'll probably pack down our camp and uh, start driving. We're just north of uh, Bishop, California. We found this bitchin' camp spot here, uh, right on the Owens River. We got camp set up right here. We're gonna go rafting today down the Owens River through Pleasant Valley on the Explorers. Do a quick ore check. I'm gonna handle this side. Way better. <laughs> Austin's going in the bushes. Oh god! We're gonna see bushes! Woo! Look at these ripples right here! Rapids! Woo! Look at Austin! Turn us, turn us, turn us. Come on, I'm gonna try to hold it. I'm gonna stop at camp though, because I'm I may or may not have hit a tree that could potentially have popped us. Cool. That was nice. It is about eight o'clock and we are maybe 10 minutes less than away from the trailhead that we're headed to for the night. We're gonna be going up to Coyote Flats and then taking a trail over to Funnel Lake or one of the lakes in the area. We're gonna be doing a little bit of off-roading, a little bit of exploring, and it should be a good time. So it is Wednesday. We pulled into Funnel Lake pretty late last night, 10 or 11 o'clock. Uh, there were actually quite a few people all around the lake we ended up just kind of pulling off way over there and sleeping for the night woke up this morning and quite a few people left uh, pretty early so we grabbed this spot right on the lake it's beautiful and eventually everybody cleared out of here and so now we have this entire lake to ourselves uh, at least for the time being and it's, it's beautiful out here we're gonna take a hike around the lake and do a, a little bit of fishing Wish us luck. We're hiking over to the next lake over. I think it's called Rock Bottom Lake and we're gonna do a little fishing there. pretty darn good. Honestly, these tacos, probably one of the best camp meals. Mm. Check that out. Good morning, I am a sleepy guy. Recording live from my bed. It's nice. Taylor downstairs making some coffee today. The wind is messing up my boil. She's got a boil on her face, so the wind irritates it. Right, babe? What? 
I said you have a boil on your face and the wind irritates it, right? That's not what I said. That's what she said. Gonna hike over to Rock Bottom Lake again, try to do some fishing. to uh, Mammoth Laurel Lakes area so hopefully it's not too crowded it is Friday uh, about 4 30 in the afternoon I know we are uh, a little bit late to get out there but uh, I really hope we can find a spot somewhere around that area if not in that area um, today was pretty nice uh, our friend Austin left and we went into the town of Bishop to get a couple things handled so see what Mammoth has in store for us stay tuned guys was full when we pulled up there earlier so we drove down the mountain a few miles and found this cool little spot by the stream so we're gonna call this place home for the next night or two we just woke up from a nap a little hammock nap now it's time to uh, put on some more layers because the sun went down, it got a little chilly. Maybe make some burgers for dinner. Hey, good morning guys. We woke up about 8 a.m. this morning and we decided we're gonna make some coffee, maybe a hammock for a minute, but we'll start packing up and we'll head uh, into Mammoth area. From there, we're gonna just restock on a couple of things and then we're gonna head back out. Good morning, it's uh, currently about 6.23 a.m. We're right outside of Mammoth Lakes, California, and we are gonna go hot springing. So there's a little hot spring right around the corner we're gonna take a little hike to. Update, so we made it to the hot spring to find uh, some nudists in it. So Taylor and I decided to give them their privacy, so we turned around and we're headed back to camp. I think what we're gonna do is just pack up our camp and uh, head back over to that hot spring. Hopefully they're done by then. So stay tuned. We got a sunset hot spring. Finally. Finally. This tub was full all day. There was a lot of people coming through. So mm -hmm. finally people dispersed right before sunset. So we were able to sneak in here and get the tub to ourselves for sunset. So that's real nice. Definitely worth the wait. so much for watching our video episode four we hope you enjoyed part one of our journey through the eastern sierras we'd really appreciate it if you guys liked the video please be sure to go down and actually hit the like button there and of course subscribe to view more of our content if you guys have any recommendations on places that you think we should go or suggestions in general or just to let us know what you think be sure to drop a comment down below as well for us thank you guys so much for watching and uh be sure to stay tuned for part two of the eastern sierras Hopefully we'll be dropping that here shortly. And we will see you guys soon. Take care. Bye.